Hello everybody. Welcome back to the shop. We're going to take these rolls apart this morning. Okay, got all my boards done. May. Couldn't do this last night, but man, I wasn't feeling so good. I felt like in that flu bug a little bit. Show must go on. Okay. Now, no need to mark these or anything. Just this goes in the back. And um, the holes will only match up on the wing they're supposed to go on because I just drilled them randomly. Okay, now what I gotta do is get the old glasses on. Get the old multi I forgot to put my wedges in here. This is beautiful right there. Yes, sir. Nice edges. That's a nice mold right there, guys. Oh, yeah. I got a little trick to do here, too. Because if we just run our foam down and around in this, well, that wing's going to want to bend right there it'll do the accordion effect you know so uh, but I got a little trick I'm going to show you on that to keep that from happening okay now bam oh, bam oh yeah Chips, but I think they came from inch. Nothing chipped. Oh, that's where they came from. It is, but that's okay. That's my wedges now. I to put a little clay. Bring that clay out. See, so, you know, also what I did is I scribed in my primer where the hinges go. You guys see that? 
you know, in here. And uh, so they'll come out uh, on the part, and you know exactly where to put them hinges. Now I'm going to do them on the flaps and the ailerons too. Success. Bam. Yellow aircraft F-18 mold right there, baby. PVA, all that is a part of, see, that's why it don't look shiny, it will, when we get her washed up. Sick for about a month and a half. I mean, bad sick. <coughs> well, I'm pretty much done with these wings now, but they're just plugs. And I always want to keep you want to keep the pl plugs with the molds. Just in case you got to do any repair or make a half or anything like that, you got to save your plug. But I sure like these edges on these molds, so you know. But it's still you could still you know tweak them a little bit to get pop them parts right out. Works really well. Okay, bam. And uh, I think these are these are exactly the same length. And uh, Brian called me this morning, and he was just kind of curious. Curious. He's got a yellow aircraft. His wings from the outside edges were 11 and 5 sixteenths. And that's exactly what these are. So Brian, I think you're good to go. But what we're going to do, see if you're building a new F-18, it don't matter. Because you place your bulkheads, you, you know, you plug your wings in and glue your bulkheads in. But on an existing yellow aircraft, They're just wondering if these will work. And I think they will. I think what I'll, I'm not going to glue these in. Okay? So the worst case scenario, you might just have to do a little sanding inside there. I'm gonna glue a piece of sandpaper to a stick and, and kind of water them out. But they should fit on any yellow earth. Bam, here we go, baby. Bam. Well, too much. Get her cracked open. Come over to the other side. Come over to the dark side. Cleaned up 
day. Get some wax on. Uh, prime up some more. Prime up some more uh, 105 parts while I'm priming these up. But we're going to do some testing. I'm going to lay up a wing and Gelo test on it. Bam. It's just beautiful. Nice detail. Oh yeah, that's going to bust out a lot of nice wings right there my edge. This is absolutely perfect. All the way around. Clean that clay up. And uh, wash the part all off. And I love how they sit flat like this. Easy to lay up, easy to vacuum bag. You got to keep your holes and these nubs far enough away to where you can get some tack tape on this edge. Sometimes some primer. It's kind of hard to get off. Best thing to use when you're washing it, instead of scraping on it with metal or something, when I'm washing it, I'll scrape it with this right here, and it won't do no damage. You know, it won't pour up the mold. As soon as it gets wet, it'll come right off. Just a little primer. That's where I made them marks. I should have waxed that a little heavier. Not a big deal. I mainly like to see it nice and clean in. Bam! There you go, guys. Should make a nice set of wing molds right there. These flanges. We'll always keep this wing square. Keep it from warping or anything. And we'll get one laid up this week. Bam! See you back in the shop.